what up y'all welcome to the video as y'all come in y'all smash the like button and subscribe to the channel you ain't subscribed already and um today i want to do this video uh i seen or whatever you know it's a channel that goes by the name of marco boxing and um he interviewed shane mosley right to get his prediction for the earl spence versus terrence crawford and uh the, the the amount of of idiotic <laughs> that I heard out of Shane Mosley mouth was just so ridiculous. Cause usually I see some of these interviews, I heard some of these people takes. I can just pass by them. I pick the the good ones out of out of the ones I watch or whatever. But this was just so crazy. I just had to do a video on it. I said, wow. And uh, where's all the guys that runs around talking about, you don't know boxing, you don't know boxing, you don't know boxing. So where is those guys, man? <laughs> Check this out. I just want y'all to listen. Listen clearly. Let me turn it all the way up real quick. Hold on. I'm sitting in my car. I got my laptop with me. Let me turn it all the way up. Just take a listen, man. Who do you have in that fight? You know, I, I, I can only go back. Should have known he, he didn't know what he was talking about when he took that deep breath. <laughs> Anytime you, you ask somebody, hey, man, who you got in the Earl Spence versus Turner Crawford fight? And, and they take a deep breath. They either about to lie or, or they don't know what they talking about. But I, what I've heard that Spence is kind of did some damage to... Uh, you know, Crawford before when they, you know, sparred and stuff like that. A long time when he was sparring with uh, uh, Floyd. And. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he said Earl Smith did. He heard Earl Smith did some damage to Terrence Crawford. Huh? Last time I checked, man, Earl Smith never sparred Terrence Crawford, bro. I, I, I know that for a fact. You feel me? So. I don't know what Shane Mosley's talking about, but there's there's one strike. That's finished. You know, he had the accident, but it looked like he, he jumped back. You know, I think that it's gonna be he's too patient for he might be too patient for Crawford. Like two two. That's strike number two. You're almost out already. And and we we still in the first inning. <laughs> he almost out already, you hear me? <laughs> He said Earl Smith is too patient for Crawford. What? It, it, it's to the point where I I I know he don't even watch these dudes, man. He don't even watch them, man. I'm talking about zero. He don't watch them at all. Cause, cause the fact that anybody say that Earl Smith is patient don't know what they talking about. Facts. When have Earl Smith ever been patient? When? So. Strike number two. He's too long. He's too tall. He's in the ring with big guys all the time, getting banged up. And he, he said Earl Smith is too long, too tall. He always in the ring with big guys getting banged up. That's strike number three right there. Cause, cause, it's just, it's just, first of all, Earl Smith ain't ain't tall. Like he about an inch taller than Bud, but he ain't tall, bro. It's not tall, bro, at all. Like in Houston, like Jamal Charlo, uh, uh, Laura. I mean, he's in the he's in the ring with all kind of champions there around his weight class. They're they're good, um, and they're bigger. So I think that you know he will be able, be able to withstand a per fight, especially uh, especially at fifty four. But forty seven might be a little harder because it's a little weight, but. I don't know. I just got. I mean, Crawford is a great fighter, and Crawford has a, more of a mentality when he gets in the, the ring and fight, like I did. Yeah. Um, I just think that's gonna be harder for him to to to, to fight with a guy he's been in the ring with before. They both know each other. They both know what's going on. <laughs> Even the dude on the panel with Shane Mosley, they look. He looked in the air like. Huh? When 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 the Earl 
Spartan turned 12 for me for. He, he was trying to think, did that ever happen? He almost tricked him into thinking it, was, it happened. Like, come on, man. <laughs> I mean, Marco better off. I seen this interview with Best Fight the Best and everybody else. He better off sticking with that, bro. Stick with it. Best Fight the Best and and and, and got down. Go get some more. Yeah, I even come on that joint. You hear me? I, I don't care. Get somebody else, bro. Because these these type of dudes, man, don't know. Don't have a clue what they talking about. This man said that Earl Smith been in the ring with Jamal and Laura. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't been in the ring with neither one of them before. Not one. So Shane Mose, I don't know if it's if it's the drunk that was punched or I, I don't know, man. But this man don't know what you talking about, man. And, 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 and it's almost crazy. So the interview looked like it's three minutes. I hope it was really three minutes and this ain't just a clip and they just cut it because I would have had to cut this short ASAP. Cause this man been laid up, tied up somewhere, and, and Lord no, don't know what he been going on with, well, man. <laughs> this, this, this is this is crazy, bro. And you know, I think. Well, no, man, I, I don't want to play it no more. That's it, man. That's it. Let me close the laptop. That's it for him, man. That man don't have a clue, man. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hey, go go get somebody else, bro. It's a lot of other people, man. These legends, they don't be watching boxing and they don't know nothing, man. Go get go. It's just, I can name a bunch of people for you, but him, it ain't it, man. You know, but it is what it is. Now, I just want the people who know everything about boxing. I wanted them to know that. Shay Mosley didn't have a clue. Y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Yeah, subscribe already, man. I'm out, man. Deuce.